Welcome to the channel. On today's episode, I'm looking for a very old god, but I'm looking for him in a very unusual place. I'm in a very busy place, a very cold place, a very windy place, and it smells like weed. Yes, I'm in Amsterdam today to search for the old Celtic and Gaelic god Cernunos. Well, first of all, who is Cernunos? Well, if you translate his name from Gaelic, it means the horned one. So CERN means horn, and in Old Roman, uh, I believe it's corn that means horn. So unicorn, just one horn, CERN, corn, horn. He is the god of the wild and the woods. There are very few written sources on him. But he lives deep in the forest. But today we're going to look for him, and we're going to find him in the busiest of places. Let's go. Okay, so we're here right now in Amsterdam Central Station and the fun already starts here. Uh, when you come out of Amsterdam Central Station, you see Amsterdam here probably for the first time. But this beautiful old building has lots of beautiful icons on it. And there's also a lot of Christian symbolism here. But like if you go up and up and up, then uh, maybe you can already start to film up. Then you see like above here is the crest of the city of Amsterdam. And above there is the line which represents hound. And what's above there is a guy with horns. The Gaelic god Cernunos looking over the city. That's a good way to start the video now, isn't it? Uh, excuse me, we're looking for some images of the god uh, Cernunos and uh, with the horns and for the, it's for YouTube, uh, don't worry, it's a small channel, nobody watches, what? It's probably stoned. And over here, at the Prinsengracht. Who's that surrounded by leaves? Okay, so the day is already coming to an end because it's December and the sun goes down really fast now. Um, you think these things are just coincidental, that there's just like one or two images of Cernunos around Amsterdam. Well, that's not true. There are lots of images of Cernunos. The central station that I showed you in the beginning of this video has over 52 images of Cernunos chiseled into the very foundation. Um, the National Museum on the other side of the city has about 23 images of Cernunos all around it. Um, like so, uh, other buildings around other streets and you think it's only Amsterdam, it's not only Amsterdam. You can find lots of images in Cernunos, in Den Haag, in Haarlem, in Delft, in Gouda, everywhere. So first out, shout out to Abe de Verteller who pointed me to uh, the fact that there are so many images of Cernunos in every city of Den Haag. Uh, now, first off, is it significant for paganism that this exists? Well, yes and no. Uh, no in the sense that it's not the case that Amsterdam was founded by a bunch of pagans, because it clearly wasn't. Um, but it is significant to me, and that's why I wanted to share it, because I always had the feeling since I was little that I kind of didn't belong here and the culture didn't really fit, because everything was fast and everything was shallow, so I missed I miss the old gods and, and I've traveled to a lot of places. And now that I'm older, I finally put my feet on two grounds here in Holland and to find out that the depth that I was looking for, that the old gods 
are chiseled into the very foundation of the most important buildings in the most important city of the country I was born in, really gives me this feeling that everything has come full circle. Uh, there's a Facebook group, by the way, that's called Green Man in Holland. You can join that and you have other people scouring the cities of Holland to find more images of the Green Man who've been hidden. Uh, the Green Man is a very old deity, probably older than Germanic deities. There's very little known about him, but he's this wild aspect of nature. He's kind of like this bridge between uh, the world of nature and the world of man. So the fact that here in the center of Amsterdam, completely surrounded by crime, football hooligans, whores and weed, that they're still a reminder of Holland's pagan past. Uh, thanks for joining me. If you want more stupid content like this, let me know. If you hate content like this, also let me know. And I'll see you all next week. Ga met de goden!